Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to install the Black Ops 3 modded client called Boy, which by the way is PC only. And this of course comes after its supposed shutdown and you will still be able to play online and on servers. If you're wondering what's the purpose of the modded client, well it allows you to play the game with improved security, so it will be patching any vulnerabilities in the game's code and systems. There will be improved stability with bug fixes and issues all being sorted out. And there will also be improved performance with higher frame rates and smoother gameplay overall. There's also going to be ranked servers, so you'll be able to rank up on dedicated servers, workshop support, and of course controller support amongst a bunch of other reasons you might want to get it. So first things first is you're obviously going to need a copy of Black Ops 3. If you do not have a copy of Black Ops 3, then simply join our Discord linked in the description down below where we may be able to gift you one. But once you have Black Ops 3, open up the game folder for it, which if you have it on Steam here, just go to manage by right clicking and then go to browse local files. And here you have the game files for the game. So just find your Black Ops 3 game folder, wherever it might be. Once you have that, you're going to need to download these two files here, which I will link in the description down below, as well as in our Discord. And once you have these, you simply want to drag the boy1exe into here. And you can go ahead and actually just run it right now. And it should like install itself real quick. And you could just press play to boot it up. First time booting it up, it may ask you to allow it. So just go ahead and allow access to it. And if you have any issues booting up the game, I will link this in the description down below, which is an FAQ guide. So you can find everything you might need if you have any issues and stuff like that. And the resolutions are in there. But after your first time booting up the game, you can press tilde on the top left of your keyboard above tab and do name, space, whatever you want your username to be, and then press enter and tilde again to close it. And you might have to enter a menu or something like that to actually update the username. Now, I will be showing you guys how to access the servers because it is not through the IW4 browser, it's through something else. But first, let's just show you guys some stuff real quick, how to unlock all and all that stuff. So if you go to multiplayer or zombies, doesn't really matter, and go to play, you can then go to stats, and you can here's where you can customize your stats. You can unlock all loot, unlock all purchases, create class slots, attachments, etc., rank, prestige, set it to however you want. So then whenever you go to whatever, you will have everything unlocked, all the DLC guns, everything behind loot boxes and supply drops. And this means in zombies, you will have unlimited of all the mega gobble gums as well. And you can actually rank up in prestige while playing on servers in multiplayer and zombies which is fantastic even if it's custom maps or mods and speaking of that I have another video for downloading maps and mods if you do not have black ops 3 on steam and of course there is native controller support so you could just plug in your controller and get that hooked up but now let me show you guys how to actually join servers so now that you've booted up the game for the first time, you might need to refresh the folder by backing out of it and reopening it. And you should find B-O-I-I-I -I -I players, open that up, and then open up user. And now that you have user opened up, find the favorite servers text that you should have downloaded as well, and drag this into the user folder here and replace it if you have another one, and then let that be in there. And then now you can go back to the boy exe and run it real quick. And by the way, if it says it's dangerous, you just press more info and allow it and I'll let it run because windows might think it's a virus or something like that but trust me it's not it's perfectly safe so now that you're back on the game you can go to multiplayer or zombies i'm just going to go to multiplayer for this showcase here and then now you can actually go to server browser and tab over to favorites and press refresh so that it's fully refreshed and this favorites list will now be there the list may have some servers get shut down in the future but i will replace the download with any future server list that there may need to, need to be so just keep in mind when joining a server if it's a custom app it won't let you join it and if it's a dlc map it may just crash your game or kick you out so avoid stuff you don't actually have if you are gifted the game through our discord it will include all the dlc as well and if you need to install custom apps you could do that through the steam workshop or through through the other method in the video at the end screen coming up. So I actually don't have any DLC installed on this version of the game, so let me just try to find a server that does not have DLC installed. So here we are on a server. Let me just choose a class really quick. This is my second time connecting to this server. And you can see even servers that say there's like zero people on, they're still bots. And as this gets more exposure, I'm sure there'll be even more people joining in on these servers and playing with you guys. So here you guys go. You can now play with your friends, play online on servers again on Black Ops 3 in multiplayer and zombies, modded stuff, custom stuff, as long as you download it all, of course. And it's really cool. The boy client is back and better than ever, pretty much, you could say. 
because now it's actually working and anyone can get it and play it. So yeah, if you guys found this useful, be sure to smash that like button, subscribe for more clients that I'll make videos on in the future. And until next time, guys, I will catch you guys in another one very, very soon. Peace out.